welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. It is Wednesday, so it is what I eat in a day. One of my favorite days of the week. I have a super fun day planned for us. I have a haul, a new product that I wanna share with you that I actually saw over on another YouTube channel and I had to pick it up for myself and I am so glad that I bought it because it is awesome. So I'm gonna be sharing that with you. Diesel and Lola, of course, will make an appearance. You'll see my food throughout the entire day as well as a really delicious dinner recipe. So definitely stay tuned for that. So make sure that you're subscribed and that your bell is turned on so you don't miss a single video. I do a what I eat in a day every single Wednesday, so don't miss out. Thumbs up this video if you are as excited as I am about today, and let's jump right into this what I eat in a day on WW. So here is breakfast this morning. It's a little after seven. So down here on the bottom, I have one of the Ezekiel pita pockets. I love these. They have great ingredients, five grams of fiber. So it's a nice base for like a spin on a toast basically. So I have one of those. I have two eggs. I did season my eggs with the Trader Joe's onion salt, and then I topped it with one of the Good & Gather, which is Target's brand, extra thin mild cheddar slices. They are only one point for one slice. So my breakfast is two points for the pita, one point for the cheese is three points, and then zero for the eggs and zero for the honeydew. This honeydew is stellar, so it is in season. It's delicious. I picked this one up at Trader Joe's. So this is my three smart point breakfast. It's always a good day when your Imperfect Foods box comes. As you guys know, I love Imperfect Foods. I was excited when my box came today. Look what it says. Thank you for helping us build a better food system together. They are going on their five year anniversary of stopping food waste so that is so exciting i always love getting my box i do get mine every two weeks so i sign up for it every two weeks you can customize it pick the items that you want and then it shows up on your doorstep so this is my box for these next two weeks are you excited about imperfect foods bud yeah all right, so the first thing I picked up was this pack of organic blueberries. This is such a great deal. I didn't mention, but their prices are, they can't be beat for produce, conventional, or organic. And again, you're stopping food waste because you're buying up this product instead of having it thrown away. And you'll see everything looks just as good as you would find it in the store. So I did get these organic blueberries, three avocados. I generally do not buy my avocados organic because you actually remove the peel, which is where the pesticides are. So they're not necessarily supposed to be purchased organic i mean you can if you choose to i just generally don't some baby bok choy this is organic i love bok choy and when i saw that as an option i got so excited now what you can buy changes every time you order so you can try some new produce which is always fun two huge nice organic zucchinis grapefruits also purchased organic mangoes look at these i expected to have large mangoes but this is like the perfect size just for one sitting of fruit so i have six little organic mangoes and then some organic grapes because we love grapes so that's everything that i picked up that was produce and then some new fun things is i grabbed two of these stump town cold brew coffees these have zero calories so they're zero points and again you can try new things and find some new favorites so i've never tried this but i was excited so i got two little cans of that and then i also got this ground works cold brew coffee this is a nitro and there is three calories in this so obviously that would be zero points as well well, I have bought these teas in the past and you guys know I really liked these. These are just organic unsweetened green tea. Teas teas. They're actually really delicious. So of course I had to buy three more. 99 cents a piece which is a great deal. 
And then I grabbed this organic white cheddar. This is mainly for my husband. I eat full fat cheese as well. So I thought I would grab that. And then I love these. These are the Fontina snacking cheeses. I've actually bought these before from Imperfect Foods and they're 70 calories a piece. They're great little wedges of cheese. They're really, really good. And then I really like this True Story brand. I've bought their, um, oh my gosh, hot dogs and their sausages. And this is their oven roasted turkey breast. So this would be zero points on both blue and purple. And all that's in here is the turkey breast and salt. So sometimes there'll be weird things like dextrose, which is like sugar. So that's why I grabbed this. You guys know we've bought this several times. This is the Essential Baking Organic Thin Crust Pizzas. Pizza crust, these are the best. We love these pizza crusts. They're perfect just to have the whole pizza for yourself for 450 calories for the entire pizza, which is not bad. Has good ingredients. It's even made with olive oil. So I grabbed those. Again, this is like the third time we've bought this. We love these. And then I got this for my husband. He likes meat and cheese because, you know, men, they love their meats and their cheeses. This is a Alpine style cheese and cracker pack. And then it looks like there's some little cranberries in there it even comes with this cute little pick to grab the cheeses so quite a bit of cheese and crackers so that'll be nice to throw in his lunch and lastly I grabbed the organic sharp cheddar because this was a killer deal for organic cheese and sharp cheddar is my favorite so you guys know I eat full fat cheese full fat dairy so I'll definitely eat that I love these and I'm pretty excited to try that so that is everything this time from my imperfect foods I do have a link where you'll get ten dollars off your first box so definitely check it out if you want to help with food waste get some great deals try some new things highly recommend I am going to sip on some kombucha I am actually going to have some cottage cheese as a morning snack here in a little bit but it is about nine o'clock and I'm just going to pop this open so I want to let you know that this is about to go down so I am about to have my cottage cheese it is 10 o'clock so I have one serving of my favorite cottage cheese the good culture I'll top it with a little bit of pepper and that will be my snack I'm still working here on my kombucha there isn't a whole lot left but I am still working on my kombucha as well so this is my three smart point snack I'm so excited to share this with you guys. This is a subscription box that I found that I subscribe to. This is not sponsored. This is, I paid for it with my own money because I am so excited about this. This is the Miss Muscle Box subscription. You guys, this is all fitness. They send you snacks to try all the new rage and fitness related items and every month as part of your subscription you actually get a piece of workout clothing so it's incredible if you are someone that's super into active wear like i am it's nice to get a new piece of fitness clothing every month that you can wear to the gym or in my case jazzercise so i signed up for the subscription it is monthly i will put all of the information down below that i use to sign up and a link for you guys to sign up if you're interested but you guys, get this box and join me in getting this Miss Muscle Box every month. And I did buy a couple of extra tank tops as well, so I'm going to show you guys that. But first things first, let's dig in to the box. So this is what the inside looks like. I haven't even opened anything up yet. So it looks like there's some information here on PB Fit. And then it looks like they give you, so this is my first box, so I'm kind of learning right along with you guys. Looks like they give you a little Miss Muscle Box book. Oh, look at this. It gives you some workout ideas. That's pretty awesome. So actually a whole week of workouts. And then also it gives you some example of some nutrition ideas. Yeah, this is great because not only does it give you fitness gear, it also kind of just helps you with your overall fitness journey. So I really like that. And here's what we got. Oh, look at this. So this is a full size jar of the organic PB Fit. So this is a 15 ounce jar. So this came in the box. And if I remember right, the box is $30 a month. I'll put it on the screen if I'm wrong. I actually ordered this a while ago. I'm just now getting around to showing it to you guys. So that's awesome that you got a whole jar of that. And then it looks like we were sent a grenade go nuts bar in salted penis. This is a 
protein bar with salted peanuts. It's 180 calories. I'll put points here on the screen. I don't know the points right off the top of my head, but it does say nothing artificial right here. So I'm hoping the ingredients are good. So there's one of those. And then I've actually heard about these. So I'm excited to get these in the box. I've never tried them. These are the gluten-free cookie bites. Enjoy a mindful indulgence. This is the chocolate chip and let's look here so it looks like one cookie is 110 calories and there are two cookies in the pack i did take a look at the ingredients they're not bad actually at all the only thing i didn't like was the oil so but really not bad so they sent me the chocolate chip and also the snickerdoodle so so far i've gotten all of that but of course the star of the show i'm here let's work out so this is the piece of activewear it comes in this super super cute resealable bag so this is definitely something you could reuse like if you go to the pool you could throw your wetsuit in there it'd be great for traveling so i am going to keep these little reusable bags but let's see what piece of activewear i got so i don't know if you guys can see that but on the t it says don't sweat it so this is what's called a hyper tea so it helps wick sweat and it looks like it's an actual like t-shirt style of shirt i'm so excited you guys this is buttery soft you get to select your size for the clothing as well that comes in your box so you can make sure that it's going to fit so i got the shirt which is worth the price of the box by itself a full size of the pb fit both packages of cookie bites and the bar and then of course i'm pretty excited actually about this nice reusable bag and then some workouts and some nutrition information so when you sign up for muscle box you actually get 30 percent off if you want to buy something on their website so they have additional clothing and fitness related things so i took advantage of that and bought two tank tops so this one says hustle for the muscle and then this one says girl power yes ma'am so i grabbed both of these i'm always looking like I said, for great fitness wear for Jazzercise and at 30% off, I feel like both of these together were less than $40. So not bad. So yeah, definitely check it out. You guys, I think you would love getting the muscle box. It's made just for women. So it's nice that it's tailored for us. And this is a fantastic deal. Again, everything is linked down below. So here is lunch today. This is what I've coined the Jen salad. This is kind of my original put together salad. It is on my website. I'll put my website here on the screen and it is linked down below as well. But this is literally my favorite salad hands hands down. So I'm going to show you what's in the salad. But again, the recipe is on my website. So first thing I did is cooked my chicken and I did cook my chicken in my little copper chef air fryer. So this is what it looks like. It's just a small basket style. We like it because it's great for one or two people. I did got, buy this off of Amazon. So I'll link that for you guys as well. But the chicken that I used for my salad is the cauliflower new chick on the block in spicy ish now the regular is really good too i don't like spicy but in this salad this chicken is amazing and i think it's because it couples really good with the sweetness of the strawberries and the balsamic so i have three pieces or three points worth of the chicken I just used this spring mix from Costco and then I put in just a little bit of basil because I do like fresh basil in my salad and then some red onion that I had chopped up and then I topped it with one ounce of this Roth buttermilk blue cheese. I picked this up in my Imperfect Foods order which this is the best blue cheese I've ever had. Imperfect Foods is linked down below with $10 off your first box. You guys know how I feel about Imperfect Foods. We talked about it when I showed you my haul earlier in this video. So definitely recommend that. I have one tablespoon of raw sunflower seeds from Trader Joe's. These are actually my favorite. And then I have about a half of a cup of sliced strawberries. And my dressing is also on my website. It's balsamic. Dijon mustard, avocado oil, salt, and pepper. The easiest dressing ever, and it's only two smart points. So for my salad, it is two points for the dressing, three points for the chicken, four points for the blue cheese, because the blue cheese is a little bit higher than feta. I'm just out of feta. And then one point for the sunflower seeds. So this is 10 points of amazing deliciousness. It's huge. 
I can't wait to dig in. I'm also going to have this Stump Town Original Cold Brew Coffee. This is zero points. I did pick this also up at my Imperfect Foods box, and then I added 10 calories or zero points worth of the Nut Pods and Toasted Marshmallow. This is a seasonal one. I'll link the Cafe Latte Pack that I bought with the chocolate, the toasted marshmallow and cinnamon down below for you guys as well, but I put in just a tiny bit. I kind of need a little bit of a boost of coffee and then I'll probably have something for dessert, but I'll be back to show you that if I decide to do that. So this is my dessert or the rest of my lunch, I should say. This is two smart points. It is a two good yogurt and coconut. Most of the time I top it with granola, but I'm not really feeling that. I think I'm just gonna have it plain. So this is the last for lunch. I'll see you guys a little bit later when I make my afternoon snack. Hey guys, I have been getting a ton of questions on my greens. So these are the greens that I take every day. These are the My Adventure to Fit greens in the banana apple flavor. These are exceptional. So if you do struggle to get your greens in every single day, this is a really good option. Nice, pretty clean ingredient. They taste really good. So what I've been doing is dry scooping them. So I wanted to show you guys how I do that. But also I saw over on a little less Ashley, who I love if you guys don't watch her channel, she had someone reach out to her and said that they kind of choked uh, dry scooping the greens. So if you are nervous about that, then please mix this with water. Better safe than sorry. But what I do generally is I always have my container of water. This is my coffee over cardio caffeine loading tumbler. I love this. This is what the greens look like. So what I'll do is I will take the scoop of greens. So basically that. So first thing I'm gonna do is put a little water. And that's it. So that's basically what's involved in dry scooping. Again, if you're not comfortable with it or you're not sure if dry scooping is really the way for you, then just take the greens, mix them with a little bit of water. I do have 10% off for these greens, so I'll make sure that I link this down below for you guys. But I love it, and it's just a surefire way that I'm going to get my greens in every day. I think when I die, I want to come back as this one or this one yeah i think that's what i want to do bud you got the best life ever huh babe yeah you should do afternoon snack time it is about 2 40. i'm about to get on my monthly zoom call with my challenge group one of my favorite times of the month so i'm gonna have a nyx sticks and I actually picked these up at my local health food store. I showed these in a grocery haul a couple of weeks ago. They are 75 calories or two smart points with 10 grams of protein for two sticks, which is a killer, killer deal. And then I'm going to have one of these Fontina snacking cheeses. I also found these or bought these out of my Imperfect Foods box and they are my favorite little cheese. So I'm gonna have these two things for a snack, it's going to give me like 15 grams of protein and only about 140 calories. They're both waiting for their dad to come home. Somehow they know. They know when we're coming home, it's crazy. For dinner tonight, I am making barbecue chicken meatloaf and I'm gonna pair that with one of my favorite sides from Trader Joe's. So let me show you what's in the meatloaf and what side dish we're going to be having. First, you're going to need a pound of extra lean ground chicken oil of your choice, flour, barbecue sauce. I'd recommend a zero or low calorie option. I'm gonna use up what I have left here of my G Hughes. You'll also need some salt and pepper, fresh cilantro or parsley, green onions, one egg, a regular onion. And for our side dish, we are gonna do the Trader Joe's asparagus risotto because it's friggin' delicious and we love it so much. So we're gonna pair this on the side with our meatloaf. So let's get started on dinner. So we're ready to make the meatloaf. So in my bowl here, I have my pound of ground chicken. To that, I'm going to add half of a cup of diced onion and about a quarter of a cup of diced fresh cilantro. You could also use dried cilantro or parsley, whatever your preference is. We're gonna go ahead and crack in one egg. I have one third cup of flour. We're gonna do about a tablespoon and a half of barbecue sauce. I'm not gonna measure, I'm just gonna go ahead and wing it because there's hardly any calories in this barbecue sauce. Two teaspoons of avocado oil 
and again I'm just going to eyeball and err on the side of caution and we're gonna pop in a good size pinch of salt and pepper and then we're gonna mix this all together and this will form our meatloaf So I have a baking sheet here lined with parchment paper sprayed with nonstick cooking spray. We are going to free form a loaf here on the parchment paper. It's going to go in the oven at 450 degrees. So in my pan here, I have the asparagus risotto going. I just put the meatloaf in the oven, so I'm gonna let this cook kind of low and slow. This looks so good. I always add salt and pepper to any frozen Trader Joe's side dish. They're just a little bland for me. I'm sure they do that for a reason, so they kind of meet everybody's taste buds, but it's done. I added some salt and pepper. So here's the meatloaf. I just pulled it out of the oven. I'm going to spread about a quarter cup of the barbecue sauce and then cover it with the green onions, and then I'll plate it up with the risotto, and I'll be back to share points and calories. All right, so here is dinner. I The meatloaf makes only four servings. So this is a huge chunk of meatloaf. It is only two points on both blue and purple. And then it is three points on the green plan because you do have to count a little bit for the ground chicken. So that's amazing. 221 calories for the meatloaf packed full of protein. And then I have one serving of the asparagus risotto, 150 calories and four smart points. So this is a six smart point dinner for dessert tonight i'm having the brand new smart sweets this is the sour melon bites these are incredible absolutely positively delicious you get a ton in the package they are only three smart points i will insert some pictures here what they look like they are so good seriously you guys this has taken my heart for smart sweets they are not available in stores however you can go to smartsweets.com use the code jen clayton for 10 percent off orders of 30 dollars or more i highly recommend these seriously delicious Thank you so much for joining me on another What I Eat in a Day on WW. You guys, that muscle box is a must, must have. I'm going to link it down below for you guys. I'm so excited to get it every month to try new healthy snacks, to get some great fitness gear. Hello, fitness gear every month. Who doesn't like new fitness gear? So that is so exciting. I was really glad that I discovered that and was able to sign up for a subscription. So I'll link that down below for you guys, as well as the links and discount codes to some of the favorite things that I shared with you guys today and the link to head over and join my website so that you can get tonight's dinner recipe. All you have to do is click that little down arrow right under the video and it'll take you directly to the description box and everything that you need to know is down there. Make sure that you are subscribed and that your bell is turned on so you don't miss a single video. Video. I do upload most days of the week, so make sure that not only you're subscribed, but your bell's turned on so you don't miss a beat. Give this one a big thumbs up if you enjoyed today's video. It really means a lot to me and helps out my channel, so thank you so much. And of course, have a wonderful Wednesday, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Funny how the story goes, little hope of bigger dreams.